Hey guys, it's Monday. I'm just making some egg in a hole. I don't know why I already put ketchup on it, even though it's still cooking. It just felt like it. It's probably actually done. Probably cooking my egg too much. We want it yolky. And there's some red pepper here. Mm. I'm gonna quickly eat this and then I'm gonna run to Costco because we need cat litter. And that's pretty much the only thing on my list. I might also pick up a big box of goldfish crackers because Christian uses those in his lunch and it'd just be good to pick them up because Superstore only has these small packs and there's there's six packs in them, which is not very much. Plus there are much smaller packs than the Costco ones. So Costco has the bulk ones. It feels so bright out today. Yesterday was bright too, just sun, finally. Even though I'm gonna be going back down to the basement after, but you know, well, it just puts me in a good mood. <laughs> All right, here I am at the Casco. When you're in the wrong aisle, so you just climb through to get the goldfish crackers. You know, no big deal. Christian wants pants. Same thing here with pants. boxes of goldfish these thingies which I've never tried before bites, some noodles pants and the litter and I'm good to go the clip that was supposed to be the next clip turns out it didn't get recorded it's just me saying I'm back from Costco and that I was gonna show you my purse that I got off Amazon Hi, Hi. so here's the purse it's from Amazon it was $40 on amazon.ca and this keychain I added, this doesn't come with it. This was from Aldo, I got this a long time ago. But yeah, it's a nice baby pink, not too peachy, which I love. And then it has this gold here, gold, oh, I just love the gold. This is the bottom, it has little gold feetsies. This side does not have the gold things. I wish both sides had it. It has the clamshell top, like this. It's really easy to zip, because the zipper is tethered or I don't know how to say it it's just completely sewn down on both sides so real easy to zip it's one big open pouch and then it has a zipper on this side eh. and then a little pouch on this side the company is ale bags a i l b a g s where's that a t Eight bags. Oh, it's a tea, like that. Eight bags, and then it says, an inevitable bag, whoa. It also came with a long over the shoulder strap. It clips near the handles, so one on this side, one on this side. So you could wear it like this if you wanted to, whoa. I'm probably gonna just use the short handles. And then this was a little surprise. It's like a little coin pouch, lipstick pouch, tampon pouch, whatever you want it to be. Super cute. I'm just so happy I finally have my pink purse. Definitely does not go with this shirt though, but that's my black backpack purses for. <laughs> I can just switch between the two. And now I'm going to get started on my next, I almost said Friday video, I almost said Friday video, Saturday video. I'm uploading my art videos on Saturdays now. And I'm doing finally the Apron Girl redo thing. I kind of wanted it up during Artie Advent, but I was running out of time and I didn't want to rush this one, especially because it's an improvement meme. So I want to put my full effort into it. And a lot of the Artie Advent videos were rushed like a lot of the easier ones not necessarily rushed but just like they were shorter to film videos if that makes sense 
I'm such a slow drawer. Like I just, I can't rush drawing. <laughs> I'm so slow. So that's why I decided to just leave it because it would take too long. But I'm doing it now. I could have split the apron girl redo into two videos for Artie Abbott, but I wanted it to be just one because it's not just a speed paint. It's, it was like the improvement memes. I feel like the whole thing needed to be in one video. So I made a sketch and I just scanned it and I went to open it in Photoshop and instead of hitting control O, I hit control I because that's what you do in Premiere Pro and this is what I got. <laughs> oh, so freaky. You think that's freaky? <laughs> so apron girl redo number two. Well, I guess it's a third drawing, but it's the second redo. So she's either apron girl number three or apron girl redo number two. Whatever she is, she's coming along nicely. I spent a long time on this sketch. I even scanned it and tweaked things in Photoshop, just trying to get it to a point that I like. And I'm hoping it translates well when I do the line art, like tracing it onto the new piece of paper. Cause sometimes you just lose stuff in the tracing stage, but I'm really liking how it's turning out so far. I was hoping to have it traced onto the new paper by the end of the night, but I don't really want to be up late like I could. I technically kind of have the time. Well, that'd make it maybe a little too late. So I'll probably be spending at least an hour tracing it. I also did little color things. I'll show the back of the paper. <laughs> Just trying to figure out color schemes. I mean, I pretty much knew the colors I wanted the character, but then I was trying to figure out the background and I figured out something I like. So it's pretty much good to go. I can work on it again tomorrow. I don't know if I'll have time to finish it necessarily. Uh, I do have time to keep working on it on a third day if I need to, so. I can always do that. I've got the time. Three days is the max I can spend on it though, although that will be plenty. On day three, I could even work on some other stuff as well that I wanna get done. So, yeah. I'm gonna call it a night though. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Baby, I'm trying to get a thumbnail for yesterday's vlog. Oh, hi, baby. Being so brave. Hello. For those of you who've seen my Bachelorette vlog, you recognize this.